work here. <laughs> Sorry, Miss Magdalene. Uh, does this madness ever end? <sighs> Maybe I should have chosen a simpler life. On the beach, far away from any... Miss Magdalene! <gasps> Miss Magdalene! What is it, Miles? What's wrong? <sighs> the lid on the toy bin won't open! Miles, please, don't scare me like that. <laughs> Sorry, Miss Magdalene. I kept pulling and pulling, but it was locked up tight. Yes, well, did you maybe try unlocking it? <gasps> You're a genius! <gasps> Unbelievable. Ugh, of course. More emails! Oh, can't I have a moment's peace? Miss Magdalene, <gasps> the babies just had a bunch of chili and we're all out of wipes. <laughs> no. Think for yourself. They're in the supply closet. I looked there. We're totally out. No, they should be there. I ordered them last week. <laughs> Didn't I? <gasps> no, I can't believe it. Uh, I did. I missed an order? Oh, no, 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 this can't be happening. No. Uh, not to worry, boss. I'll just use my shirt. How could I let this happen? Maybe I can't cut it anymore. I'm going to make more and more mistakes, and the babies are going to suffer because of me. Baby, <laughs> That's it. I'm done. I quit. This is Maggie Magdalene, out. Did Megs really quit? Can she even do that? Wearing sunglasses inside. This dude is epic. Hey, hey, hello, my fine caretakers. Hello, you gorgeous, brilliant babies. Oh, you're so cute. <laughs> uh. As you all may or may not know, Miss Magdalene has unfortunately retired. Headquarters therefore sent me, Mr. Turnbull, call me Bull, to replace her. Uh, welcome, Mr. Turn. I mean. Welcome, Bull. <laughs> Thanks. Lonnie, right? It's Lanny. Well, they both start with L. Close enough. <laughs> totally epic. Things might work a little different around here, but in a better, more fun way. I already have one very important task that you all must complete immediately. Our very lives might just depend on it. Roller skate party! Yeah! <laughs> Whoa! Mr. Turnbull, you are the best! I said call me Bo! <laughs> Couple things to know about me. One, I hate rules. Two, I love nacho cheese. And three, babies rule! <laughs> Remember this mantra. The key to a great daycare is not to care. The key, the key to a great daycare, daycare is not to care. care. Now you're getting it. Everybody, do whatever you want. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> oh, it's all right, kid. Don't be sad. You're killing the mood. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Bull is a natural with the babies. Hey, where's the fridge in this place? It's cake o'clock and I'm hungry. Woo, Woo! Me too. Yeah. <laughs> Yuck. It smells like dirty diapers. What gives? The old diapers always get taken away when the new ones are dropped off every morning. Or not. Gross. The order didn't arrive. Megs would make me call the delivery company and complain, but... Remember, <laughs> Miles, the key to a great daycare is not to care. Right. Not to care. 
What are you looking for, T? The milk wasn't put away last night, and it all went bad. I'm looking for the key to the cupboard to see if we have anything else to offer the babies. Have you seen it? No. Oh, hang tight. Meg's always double-checked the milk was put away. T? Are you forgetting about the mantra? Um, right. The key is not... To care! Correct! <laughs> Oh, where are all the soothers? They were supposed to get washed and returned last night, but they didn't. Now I can't find any. Remember, Lanny, the key to caring is a great day care. Wait, remember, Lanny, the key to caring... Not to care. <laughs> How does he do that? Are there listening devices everywhere or something? Uh-oh. Looks like Bull didn't pay the cable bill. But the babies never miss an episode of Baby Island. I'm just trying to think Bull's not caring mantra might be not working. Maybe we just need to try not caring harder? Ooh, did we do that? Let's find Bull. Everything's going perfectly. Twilight daycare is falling apart. I expect parents will be taking their babies out of here in a matter of days. Hours, even. After that, we can buy the building cheap and build our mega mall parking lot. <gasps> Bull's a phony. That's not even his real voice. Bull is just that. A bull in a daycare. I can't believe I'm about to say this, but we really need to get Meg's back. <laughs> Aw, you guys here to help? <laughs> Great. Okay, here's the plan. Miles and Baby B, you find Mags and convince her to come back, whatever it takes. T, take Baby Zeke and get Bull to admit his plan on a recording so we have proof he's bad. I'll take the rest of the babies and keep them happy. Sound good? Yeah! yeah! <laughs> Go caretakers! Okay, babies, who wants to have some fun? Great, let's bounce. I can be unsure. What's it? Hmm, this is usually the surefire trick. Oh, you sweet little darlings miss Miss Magdalene. <sighs> Me too. <laughs> How can I help you two? We just had a few questions. Sure, but first, I got a question for y'all. What's with them funny hats? These hats? Well, they are definitely not hiding recording devices, I can tell you that. Miss <laughs> uh. <laughs> 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 Magdalene? Mags? Miss Mags? <laughs> Hmm, where would I go if I just quit my career in a fit of rage? <laughs> Baby P, wait up! I'll be honest, Bull. Baby Zeke and I had a whole good cop, bad cop thing cooked up to get you to admit that you're here to trick us. But I'll just cut to the chase. Is your plan to turn this place into a parking lot? Yes. It is. And is there anything we can do to stop you? Barring Miss Magdalene suddenly reappearing. Nope. And I should have finished my mantra earlier. The key to a great daycare is not to care if it gets closed down. <laughs> I gotta say, Bull, you're evil. But I appreciate your mega villain honesty. Zeke still thinks you're a poop head, though. Noted. Well, Maggie, you did it. No more responsibility, no more babies, and especially no more caretakers. Hi, Meg. Ah! I mean, uh, hello, Miss Megalyn. Miles, what are you doing here? I'm no longer your boss. I'm retired. Now off you two go. But everything's falling apart without you. All the milk's going bad, the TV won't work, we're out of soothers, and the dirty diapers still haven't been picked up. And all Bull does is party. Party? Sounds like you caretakers dream come true. 
Listen, Miles, that may all well be true, but I have a new chillaxin' life here on the beach, and I am never going back. <laughs> oh, sorry, Baby B. I'm afraid all the babies in the world couldn't convince me. Well, they may not be all the babies in the world, but they all love you. Miss Magdalene, we all just wanted to say how important you are to us. The walls and the toys and the cookies might still all be there, but it isn't Twilight Daycare without you. Blah, 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 blah. Plus, baby Zeke and I have Bull recorded admitting he's going to turn Twilight Daycare into a parking lot. The key to a great daycare is not to care if it closes down. <laughs> All right. Yes. All right. Let's go kick a bull in the behind. Do it. First thing when we get back, Lanny, call in a rush order of milk. Miles, pay the cable bill. We simply cannot miss Baby Island. And T, prepare the babies for nap time. They'll only be five minutes ahead of schedule, which is basically late. Bossy as ever. Music to my ears. <laughs> you know what? Twilight Daycare wouldn't be the same without you two either. You two are my best friends. Ditto. Go caretakers. <laughs> caretakers? <gasps> All the babies have sand in their diapers. Time to clean them up. Now! <laughs> Just another day at Twilight Daycare, I guess. 